Eileen Regina Shania Twain is a Canadian singer and songwriter. She has sold over 100 million records, making her the best-selling female artist in country music history and one of the best-selling music artists of all time. Her success garnered her several titles including the Queen of Country Pop. Billboard named her as the leader of the 90s country pop crossover stars. Raised in Timmins, Ontario, Twain pursued singing and songwriter from a young age before signing with Mercury Nashville Records in the early 1990s. Her self-titled debut studio album was a commercial failure upon release in 1993. After collaborating with producer and later husband Robert John Mutt Lang, Twain rose to fame with her second studio album, The Woman in Me, which brought her widespread success. It sold over 20 million copies worldwide, spawned eight singles, including Any Man of Mine and earned her a Grammy Award. Her third studio album, Come On Over, became the best-selling studio album by a female act in any genre and the best-selling country album of all time, selling over 40 million copies worldwide. Come On Over produced 12 singles, including You're Still the One, From This Moment On, That Don't Impress Me Much and Man. I Feel Like a Woman, and earned Twain four Grammy Awards. Her fourth studio album, Up, spawned eight singles, including I'm Gonna Get You Good, Coaching, and Forever and For Always, selling over 20 million copies worldwide also being certified diamond in the United States. In 2004, after releasing her greatest hits album, which produced three new singles including Party for Two, Twain entered a hiatus, revealing years later that diagnoses with Lyme disease and dysphonia led to a severely weakened singing voice. She chronicled her vocal rehabilitation on the own miniseries Why Not? With Shania Twain released her first single in six years in 2011, Today Is Your Day, and published an autobiography, From This Moment On. Twain returned to performing the following year with an exclusive concert residency at the Coliseum at Caesars Palace, Shania, Still the One, which ran until 2014. In 2015, she launched the North American Rock This Country Tour which was billed as her farewell tour. Twain released her first studio album in 15 years in 2017, now, and embarked on the Now Tour in 2018. In 2019, she started her second Las Vegas residency, Let's Go! at the Zappos Theater. Twain has received five Grammy Awards, a World Music Award, 27 BMI Songwriter Awards, stars on Canada's Walk of Fame and the Hollywood Walk of Fame, and inductions into the Canadian Music Hall of Fame and Nashville Songwriters Hall of Fame. According to the RIAA she is the only female artist in history to have three albums certified diamond by the RIAA and is the sixth best-selling female artist in the United States. Altogether, Twain is ranked as the tenth best-selling artist of the Nielsen Soundscan era. Billboard listed Twain as the 13th greatest music video female solo artist of all time. Early Life Edwards was born in Luton, England, and spent his early years there before moving to Acton, West London, where he lived with his mother Brenda Edwards, his stepfather, Patrick, and his younger sister, Tanisha. Edwards' family originate from St. Vincent and the Grenadines. As a child, he was introduced to stage school by his mother, who came forth in the second series of The X Factor in 2005. She wanted him to pursue acting and drama, however, he aspired to be successful in the music industry. He attended Acton High School and enjoyed the subjects of ICT and music. However, he struggled to attain the grades he needed for college, and as a result, had to study for an extra year. He then attended Ealing Green College, part of West London College, where he received a BTEC diploma in media moving image. During his school years, he started rapping and would film videos with his friends that would then be posted on YouTube. 
these videos would eventually become his business and the beginning of SBTV. Edwards worked for the retail chain Topman for four years to support himself financially while he ran SBTV. Career SBTV Edwards was the founder of SBTV, an online media platform to discover emerging artists. It launched in 2006 and has helped to launch the careers of many artists including Ed Sheeran, Jesse J, Stormzy and Emily Sandy. As of 2019, the SBTV YouTube channel had more than 1 million subscribers. When Edwards was 15, he was given a video camera, filmed friends rapping and performing and uploaded them to his YouTube channel. Then, he created the channel SBTV for his videos taking the initials from Smokey Bars, the name he had briefly used as a rapper. After he left school, he worked for the clothing company Topman, while continuing to make videos. His videos became more popular with hundreds of thousands of views. He was able to leave Topman to concentrate on SBTV. Initially, the channel's content was grime dance music but he then began to explore other musical genres. Edwards filmed some artists before they became well-known such as Jesse J.S. first acoustic video. He also filmed others such as Stormzy, Ed Sheeran, Dave, Emily Sandy, Rita Ora, Crept and Conan, Yunjin, Mike Righteous, Nines, Tori Kelly, Bugsy Malone, Mist, English Frank, Aaron Unknown and Cadet. In 2011, SBTV was featured in a Google Chrome advert. The ad caused the SBTV site to crash due to the traffic and it became the second most popular UK YouTube video of the year. As a result, this attracted the attention of the rapper, Dr. DRE, who invited Edwards to film him on a tour of Asia. In 2016, SBTV worked with the youth focused news service. Press Association to expand into more of a mainstream multi-channel video. Over the years Edwards constructed collaborations with some of the world's biggest stars, conducting the first online UK-based interviews with Drake, Nicki Minaj and Wiz Khalifa. Fashion As well as his online platform, Edwards released a headwear collection on Topman with American Freshman. The collection featured limited editions of snapbacks and bucket hats that were designed by Edwards himself. As part of the GQ Hero series in 2019, Edwards hosted an open forum discussion with Adwo Abo on mental health. In 2017 he made a documentary about male suicide. Edwards walked in the Hermes, step into the frame catwalk show at London's Nine Elms. In 2019, Kurt Geiger revealed Edwards as one of the faces of its characterful style campaign for AW19. Later that year, Edwards was also announced as one of the faces of the Primark AW19 collection, celebrating 50 years of the brand. Book In 2013, Edwards released an ebook, Self Belief The Vision How to Be a Success on Your Own Terms. His book achieved success and was the number one best-selling e-book series according to iBooks. It sold so well that Virgin Books bought the rights for a print edition. Music In 2019, Edwards directed the Chelsea FC remix video of grime artist K. Police style and swag. The video featured players including Callum Hudson Odoi, Ruben Loftus Cheek, Angelo Canti, Christian Pulisic. Tammy Abraham and Mitchie Batuai. In November 2021, Edwards launched the 8 billion Argentine pesos app, a groundbreaking platform supporting up and coming music stars. The app received investments from the likes of British rapper Nines, as well as early Spotify investors. It also launched with an exclusive pilot partnership with SoundCloud. In 2021, Edwards created the pseudonym Jamal Artman to launch his DJ career, paying homage to his birth name. Under this pseudonym, Edwards launched the house and dance music event Night Cultivation. Jamal Edwards Delve Securing funding from Google and the Wellcome Trust, 
in 2019 Edwards founded Jamal Edwards Delve, a grassroots youth center project. As of October 2019, Edwards had refurbished and reopened four youth centers in Acton. As of December 2020, more than 150 people have engaged across the four centers. Directing In 2021, Edwards was signed to Radical Media as a director. He later produced commercial content in partnership with the likes of Subway and Depot. Edwards also teamed up with singer-songwriter Jake Bug in 2021. Edwards directed a brand new series to showcase the unseen side of Bug's story, including his early years in Nottingham and inspiration behind his music style and lyrics. In December 2021, Edwards directed Ed Sheeran's Bad Habits remix, featuring Shan Wayne and Central C. Shortly afterwards, Edwards went on to direct Fireboy DML's Peru remix with Ed Sheeran. Other In 2017, the National Portrait Gallery, London acquired a portrait of Edwards by photographer Simon Frederick for its permanent collection. In 2018, Edwards was announced as the first ambassador for Mercedes X Class. Through his ambassadorship, Edwards launched his own YouTube series JE Self Belief and JE What's Your Drive. Edwards was keen to inspire other creatives and entrepreneurs through his vlogs exploring the challenges and dreams of a true entrepreneur of the digital native era. The vlogs presented an unparalleled insight into Edwards's busy life, featuring artists, broadcasters, filmmakers, social influencers, and more as he travelled around London and the UK showing off his pickup truck. In 2020, Edwards announced a partnership with the Department for Education a three-part campaign encouraging young creatives to consider undertaking an apprenticeship. The partnership involved the Grime MCP Money. In 2021, Jamal joined his mother, Brenda Edwards, on ITV's show Loose Women, where he shared how he built a multi-million pound business and how his mum Brenda inspired him. Edwards was also named as an ambassador for Google Pixel.